Hello, welcome to my workshop. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can make yourself a Jenga game, but an outdoor yard version. So stick around. So the first thing you want to do is take your boards, lay them out. We're just going to start with the one. Take your measuring tape and measure ten and a half inches and make a mark close to the edge. So after making your mark, you'll want to take your saw and you'll want to go ahead and cut it. Now, you can use a hand saw to cut these, but just think about this. You've got 50 cuts to make. This is going to take you a long time. So I would not recommend using that. I would recommend using a circular saw and what I'll end up doing later is actually use a miter saw which you would be even more better off to use. Now take a second 2x4 and lay it on top of your other board. This is going to give you a straight edge because you can use a carpenter square or carpenter's tee or whatever tool you'd want to create a straight line but the easiest way to do it if you don't have a whole lot of tools and your tools are limited is just to square your 2x4 on top of the one you're going to cut line that line. Now make sure your edge is the factory edge right from the store because that's always going to be a 90 degree angle. You want to line that up to the edge and then draw your line. And then you want to line your saw up to that mark and cut it. Okay so now we have this piece cut. Now this piece is going to come in handy because we're going to use this as our template to just lay on the board, make a line, lay on it, make a line as we cut. Now you can keep cutting with a circular saw, it's going to take a little longer, so I would recommend using a miter saw if you have that. So whether you're using a circular saw or a miter saw, it's important to make sure that all your pieces are not exactly the same. Now that really isn't a hard thing to achieve because a lot of times if you're cutting with your circular saw, every piece just won't be the same. But if you're on the miter saw, here's a little tip. Instead of using a block of wood as a stop block, use a piece of tape. Reason is because, like I just said, in the Jenga game, every piece is supposed to be different. You don't want every piece being exactly the same. It's part of the challenge. So to achieve that, use a piece of tape so that when you bring your block of wood up to it, you may not be perfectly on that line every time. And that will ensure that every piece is not identical. Now that these are completely cut, it's time to take some sandpaper to the edges to give a round over so it's easier to handle when you're playing the game. Now I would use probably 80 or 60 grit sandpaper, that way you could quickly get the edge off. Now you can always go with a more finer grit if you'd like to make your boards more smooth, but I'm not going to do that for my project. Now that I've got them all sanded, now it's time to apply the finish. Now it's up to you to do what you want to do. I'm going to spray paint mine red, white, and blue because of 4th of July coming up. But it's completely up to you. You can even stain it different colors or you can leave it just the way it is. Okay, now everything is finished. I've painted all the boards and they're all dry, so now it's time to go have fun and play this. I hope this project inspired you to create a game, probably, for your uh, 4th of July weekend. If not for 4th of July, maybe a different occasion. But thank you for watching this video. I hope this helped you. And please be sure to subscribe to this channel, watch all the other videos I have, and follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Pinterest. And thanks for watching. Okay, Claire. Come here. <laughs> Which one do you want to pick? Uh, belly. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, <laughs> boy. Pray. Start pray. Oh, do it. Oh, boy. Oh, dear.
I don't think it's going to stay up. Well, let's get the red one out. That one's going better. Oh, dear. Hey, here, hold it. I'm going to hold you up. <clears throat> okay, you can't do it. I'll put it up. I'll pull it up. Please? Stay back. I want to go. What? Did you, get? you want to do it again? Yeah. Oh boy, okay. Let's stack it back up. <laughs>